Welcome to Brightworks. I am always amazed every time I take one of these things apart how those engineers in Germany managed to pack so much shit in such a small little space. So M96 motor 2000 Boxster S. Um, gonna check the cam uh, tensioner pads. So it's a lot easier to do that with the engine out. While the engine's out, we're gonna get new seat covers. So, I mean, this is, and we're gonna get the bumpers painted. Unbelievable how much space all this stuff takes up. These are little cars. They're tiny little cars. How does all that shit fit in them? But, uh, yep, that is a box stair with no engine in it. So, there's a couple little gotchas in here um, as you're going along. The way they route this e-brake cable is kind of stupid, but hey, you just got to deal with it and figure out how to how to make it happen. But yeah, not only do I have stuff in front of the car, to the left front of the car, the actual car, and then over here, we got a whole nother pile of crap. So axles, exhaust, bumper. Unbelievable how much stuff they are able to fit into one of these little boxsters. But uh, 3.2 liter engine, just gonna go through it, do all the stuff you should do, and then who knows, maybe we'll sell this one. But uh, yeah, longitudinals, seats, this one I put back the engine carrier since I don't know how long I'm gonna have the motor out and we are gonna have to roll the car around. Put the engine carrier back in and I put the little tray back in. That just kind of locates the suspension, keeps everything from getting too uh, stressed. But uh, I do like the little hanger. Never did that before. This time I decided bleeding the clutch. Let's just pull the slave and not have to worry about that. But uh, yeah, so some people spend their July 4th shooting off fireworks. And around here, we pull uh, engines out of cars. I did cheat a little bit though, because I do have an AC uh, machine. I ended up uh, leaving the compressor on the motor. Everybody in the DIY world talks about, uh, oh, you gotta take the compressor off while it's in the car. Yeah, no thanks. I just evac'd it and said, hey, I can use that stuff in the future. This is the oddball um, Canon slash GIAC slash who knows what. But we're gonna try and see if we can. It's thrown a cell uh, check engine light ever since we had it. So that would be uh, seven years. And Let's see if we can fix that. I think it has to do with the fab speed, full exhaust, headers, everything, and uh, the GIAC tune. So we'll check it out and see. But I am sure there will be some little videos on this one. This, uh, this little guy's name is Jeb, and that was because he couldn't live up to what his big brother did, which would be the 911. Get it? Oh, terrible jokes around here. Anyway, hey, thanks for watching. If you like these kind of videos, click that subscribe button. We'll keep doing it. And uh, happy July 4th. And we'll keep in touch. Check us out at brightworks.com.